With lots of courage and support, Ukraine's army is continuing to defend its country. Russia invaded Ukraine approximately 10 months ago. Both armies have fought through this spring, summer, and fall. Russia did take over four regions, called oblasts in eastern Ukraine. But the Ukrainian army surprised Russia and the world when they recaptured parts of the oblast in September. However, there is still more to do. So far, neither army has won or lost this war. Now winter is settling into Ukraine. The deeply cold weather will change how both armies act. Experts predict that both armies will take this chance to check what has gone well, what they need to do next. They will restock on supplies, and if they can, let soldiers rest. The quick capturing and recapturing of territories that happened during the fall is not as likely over winter, experts think. Despite the cold, experts do not think that either army will be idle during this winter. The Russian army will likely be building better defenses for the areas they, they do control. The Ukrainians, however, will be countering these defenses any way they can. Fall is often muddy in eastern Ukraine, which slows down the soldiers and tanks. But in the winter, the muddy ground freezes and makes it easier to drive and walk over. It is not only the Ukrainian army that is preparing for winter. The Ukrainian people are too. The Russian army damaged several power stations and cities that provide electricity and heating to home. Repairs are underway, but will take time. The cold and dark winter will likely affect all of Ukraine, not just the armies. To help as much as possible, Ukraine's allies, including the United States, are sending more generators and other supplies to help the cities during the winter time. The people in Ukraine are being very careful with how much electricity they use to make sure there is some for everyone. The war is almost 10 months old and will likely not stop soon. But Ukraine's army and citizens continue to impress everyone with their bravery and determination.